Hello everybody, let's take a look at the Ishin TX526 video transmitter. It comes with a whip antenna, cables, and an instruction leaflet, and the model itself. This transmitter has three power levels, 25, 200 and 600 milliwatts of transmitting power can be powered from 7 to 24 volts so we can connect from 2S up to 5S battery directly on the other side you can see 7 segment display and the one push button for channel, band and power level selection once you power it on, you see a zero indicator, it means that it is not transmitting, zero power level. Uh, if you want to change a channel, you just short press the button. First channel, second, third, five, six, seven, eight, and back to the first channel. If you want to change band, you press for two seconds and the band indicator uh, starts blinking so band A, B, E, F, racing band and back again to band E, A if you want to change the power level uh, from 0 to 25, 200 and 600 you press for 5 seconds until the power level starts blinking and press short press turns 25 milliwatts 200 milliwatts and 500 600 milliwatts and cycles to 0 25 200 600 let's check the power consumption of this uh, VTX so when it is power level zero, not, not transmitting any video, power, power consumption is 40 milliamps. If we turn power level to 25 milliwatts, power consumption is about 110 milliwatts. Uh, 200 uh, milliwatts, it's 220 milliamps. And if we turn 600 milliwatts, the power consumption is about 310 milliamps. So what I like in this uh, video transmitter is easy selectable channels, bands and power level. You can even uh, set zero transmitting power, which is... Uh, pretty interesting feature and uh, it does remembers the channel setting after uh, power on and power off you can even make multiple power on power off cycles and you see it remembers the last channel setting and power setting and all settings are saved and uh, no res resetting uh, another thing which I like is this connector is pretty standard connector to uh, other similar uh, transmitters the old uh, 200 milliwatts and 600 milliwatt transmitters and the connector is straight compatible with this, you can see uh, the pinout. Come on. So it, it goes ground, audio, video, uh, again ground and power in. And another interesting thing is manual says that antenna connector is SMA female connector. Well, don't believe this manual <clears throat> because it is 
RP SMA, not SMA. It is RP SMA connector. The, the most popular antenna connector. So far, it's uh, going to be my favorite video transmitter. Uh, easy channel switching, band, power level switching. Uh, the cable is compatible with other transmitters. Another good thing, the standard RP SME connector and small size and good transmitter. Thank you for watching and put your comments below and subscribe for range test and flight videos with this transmitter.